On behalf of Nick Farr Jones, it's my very great privilege to announce the winner of the Nick Farr Jones Spirit of Rugby Award, Mr. Geoffrey Sale, OAM. Somebody said to me, get the tissues out because Sale is going to be crying. I thought I might be halfway through, but he's crying already. Classic Wallaby Jeff Sale OAM, a legend of Australian rugby. Oh, I didn't really want to come tonight because it's an embarrassing situation because all you people are what the spirit of rugby is all about. Because, because you follow rugby and rugby is an adventure and the spirit belongs to people that love a thing that gives them all those things that you said. I, I don't know that... I think rugby brings them out of you. And um, it, it, it doesn't really matter whether you're a player, you can still belong to the game. Um, even referees belong to the game, Clarky, don't they? <laughs> you know what I mean? So. <laughs> We'd have to give them a go, wouldn't we? <laughs> I'm going to interject before you get into too much trouble. I didn't say I didn't love them. <laughs> One test for the Wallabies against the All Blacks in 67. 379 club games, including 160 first grade for Ramwick. You played four first grade grand final wins, starting out as a flanker and ending your career as a front rower, but we won't go there. I don't know what happened. As Ramwick coach, you won six first grade grand finals and you took lower grade sides to four grand finals. You were secretary manager, treasurer, president. You've been patron since 2003. You're a life member of Ramwick. Where would you have been without the mighty Galloping Greens? Probably better off. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, strike me, obviously none of you know my doctor, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, feeling a bit better now, mate. Yeah. Ranwick. Uh, Ranwick's, Ranwick's a team that's in the comp. Uh, I just received uh, an award from Bill Corp, whom I hate. <laughs> Because they're sponsors of the opposition, Sydney Uni. That's the only reason. <laughs> Tony, keep the lawyers away. And the rest of the clubs in club rugby, if you want to know. <laughs> and that's the passion of the game, I can tell you. <laughs> hey? Don't give even anyone an even break, I can tell you. Because it's a, a beautiful game where you can... I've been bashed up by the best of them, I can tell you. <laughs> but loved every minute of it and made me, oh, I don't know, it's, it's, it's pretty hard to be up here and talk about what you people all know what it's all about. Uh, there's uh, two beautiful things I can tell you, I'll make you laugh, but hopefully. Checkers now coach of Australia and I'm on the official table of the ARU. <laughs> <laughs> So if you think that's passion, you go, oh, you've got it all right. Because <laughs> you've got to beat them. I remember, God bless Wally Ma, who was the, one of the great Ranwick people and told me to have a, a little glass of sherry, but to wash my mouth out of it. But I finished up liking the taste of it. <laughs> and I used to run up to the church and say my prayers before the game, every game, tried to get him on my side but I wasn't quite sure how good that was going to work <laughs> and then I'd run down the club and have a mini of Lindemann semi-sweet sherry and then I'd want to fight the world. <laughs> so if you call that passion or pride, it's all in that Lindemann semi-sweet sherry. 
<laughs> Jeffrey Sale, OAM. I just want to. <laughs>